Five Weird Creatures of the Deep Sea Chromodorus willani, also known as Willans Chromodorus is found in the warm waters of the tropical Indo-Pacific region. The Chromodorus willani boasts a stunning coloration that captivates anyone lucky enough to spot it in its natural habitat. Its elongated body, which can reach up to 4 cm in length, is adorned with a mesmerizing pattern of bright electric blue, interrupted by fine white lines and accents of orange or yellow. The Chromodorus willani is a carnivorous mollusk that feeds on sponges. It uses its specialized radula, a tooth-like feeding organ, to scrape and consume these sessile marine organisms. The sequestered toxins from the sponges contribute to the slug's defense against predators, making it an unappealing meal for most marine creatures. The blue dragonfish, also known as Glaucus atlanticus, is a fascinating and mesmerizing marine creature that appears to be straight out of a fantasy realm. It is a small, pelagic sea slug found in warm oceans around the world. The blue dragonfish has a remarkable blue hue that acts as camouflage, hiding from both predators and prey. The blue dragonfish is a highly specialized predator itself, preying on other marine creatures, such as the Portuguese man o war. It utilizes specialized appendages to capture and consume the stinging cells of its prey, storing them for its defense against potential threats. The lionfish, also known as terwa, is a stunning and distinctive marine creature with a striking appearance and venomous spines. However, beneath this captivating exterior lie venomous spines that can deliver a painful and potentially dangerous sting, they use their large pectoral fins to corner and immobilize their prey before swallowing it whole. The peacock mantis shrimp is a fascinating and extraordinary marine creature that exhibits an impressive array of shades, ranging from brilliant greens and blues to rich reds and oranges. The peacock mantis shrimp is an extremely skilled predator, equipped with specialized raptorial appendages that resemble club-like hammers. With these powerful limbs, they can deliver some of the fastest and most forceful strikes in the animal kingdom. The strike is so quick that it creates cavitation bubbles, which then implode with immense force, stunning or even killing the prey. The vampire squid, despite its eerie name, is not a true squid nor a vampire, living in the dark depths of the ocean, typically at depths between 600 to 3000 meters, 2000 to 9800 feet, the vampire squid is perfectly adapted to its deep sea habitat when disturbed or threatened, it can transform its appearance turning inside out like an umbrella to expose its stunning cloak of light the vampire squid does not feast on blood. It sustains itself on a diet of marine, tiny plankton, and other small organic particles floating in the water. It uses its long, retractable filaments called cirri to capture these particles and convey them toward its beak for consumption.